hello libras welcome back to my channel getting right into your reading libras sun moon rising and venus signs we have bring love into the situation aquarius energy and meditate and contemplate that just means just think before you react or take action into something we also have a time of healing for the few of you and be bold and make the first move okay so someone is being bold and making the first move all right we have the here you are libra as well i wanted to show right up on the board someone's definitely thinking about you they're unhappy um you guys could have not been talking for a while you know four to five months here someone could have ghosted you or left you out in the cold i do see an emperor energy they're in reverse i'm getting like they just weren't ready yet to be a leader and lead your relationship lead your connection and it's like they want to slowly come forward, but the Page of Swords energy, they're definitely watching you. Also, Libras, be um, aware of your self-critical thoughts, all right? You know, again, think before you react. I do feel like you're not going to see this person coming because you're living your life. You know, you're in your divine feminine energy, Libras. You're balanced. You're working hard on your goals here. But don't get overwhelmed if something deters you, all right? You have Sagittarius energy with temperance. Know that things will balance out for you. You know, let go of your expectations right now, Libras. We do have the Three of Pentacles and the Two of Pentacles wanted to come out, which equals this Five of Pentacles. So, you know, it's all in a change in your mindset here. Um, someone wants to work on something with you, but they feel overwhelmed, not really thinking that this can really manifest. It could be a job, project, or a lover, all right? There could be some financial difficulties that you're going through right now. Yeah, Ace of Pentacles in reverse. You could be figuring out trying to move or relocate as well. All right, there's a lot of things that's going on in your lives, Libra, which is why, you know, meditate and contemplate is here. All right, we have the Eight of Swords energy. Someone feels like they made the wrong decision, like I said, you know, and they could have financial problems here and it's like gut wrenching for them. You know, so be mindful of your energy. This could be this person's energy. We have passion. You guys had a lot of passion. You liked each other, had a lot of fun here, but then something just went completely left. We have self-absorbed narcissists. It was always about, you know, them and not you. One-sided relationship. Love by me here. Keep a positive mindset to manifest what you want. There's a new phase transformation coming in. Again, someone's going to try to rekindle things. I feel like someone left you confused and stuck, like... Just uh, mind games here. Sometimes when the Eight of Swords comes out like this, you know, they want to keep an emotional hold on you. You're going to have a lot of options, Libras. But it's going to take you to kind of emotionally walk away from the situation in order for things to come in. Yeah, there's a chapter that hasn't been closed for you. Someone's definitely getting advice in regards to you as well, trying to figure out which cups to give you to get back into your good graces. This could also, again, be a job here to where it's like you deserve more, you deserve a bonus or a raise, and you're not letting up stay on your ground in regards to this speak up, communicating what you want, okay? You know, justice in reverse is signifying that, you know, things are lopsided, things are unfair. So communicate to this person, whether that's a job, lover, that, you know, you deserve what you want and this is why and hold your, hold your truth, hold it, right? Look them dead in their eyes, Libras. We have the Queen of Cups in reverse. Try again, think before you react because I do see emotionally you could be all over the place and kind of lash out, which is okay, you know, but at the same time, you know, be logical, communicate how you feel without acting, you know, crazy, you know, um, not saying that you are crazy, but again, I feel like this person really played with your heart, your emotions here. We have, if you could do anything, what would it be? The answer dwells in your heart, not in your mind. Yes, for the heart is the gateway of the soul, okay? We have the five of pentacles showing up with the moon card, Pisces energy, five of wands, and six of cups. A lot of past history with this person, a lot of hidden feelings that really wasn't expressed in regards to their end here. Yeah, this person, like, your vibrations levels are off, right? Like, this person has a lot of deep thinking that they need to do Virgo energy here. And it's like, did I make the right decisions to even give this person attention? You're, go you're going to go through a tire moment very soon if you haven't already yet. Where it's like, wait a minute, this is person isn't giving me what I want. And it's time for me to skedaddle here. You know, three of cups energy. The third party, again, could be a job. Could be another lover here. Um, but Libras, I'm not getting that. We have the Queen of Swords energy and the Magician. There you are. You're just on. You want more fun in your relationship and your connection. And everything just got so damn serious. And it's like, where did this happen? It's like, I want the fun back in a relationship. And if I have to leave you, then I will, you know. So Libras, again, be bold and make the first move on what you want, okay? 
We also have your dreams need a practical plan. And then we also have nothing yet is set in stone and it's time to take action on what you want. Your masculine energy is off Libras. And it's crazy because we have your Empress energy and then there's an Emperor energy here, but they're in reverse, kind of off camera a little bit. Um, you're doing okay. It's this person. You got to cut them out. They, they need time to figure things out. Like I said, for some of you, this person goes to you. They're, they're coming back to clear the air, but I feel like they're still on games a little bit. Yeah, with the eight of wands or maybe first, you know, they're going to tell you what you want to hear, but there's not going to be as much movement, you know, which is why it's like they're coming in slowly because in regards to love, they're still blocked out with their emotions. Like, and again, it's like they're stressed. Like, it's crazy, Libras, because they're stressed out, this Virgo. You know, they're blocking you from leaving. I don't want you to leave. At the same time, it's like, get your shit together. Like, you know what I mean? Like, they're not even putting in work, really. That's the annoying part. That's why I don't like Libras. We have the Three of Swords and the Two of Wands. They're just going to continue to cause you pain, which is why Spirit is saying to death the situation with the Death Card energy. Don't look back, you know. You're not going that way. So, the world's going to be turning in your favor. This is literally, wow, karma clearing out. You have the... I haven't had this in a while, Libra. So you have the death card, the will of fortune, and karma. This is a karmic cycle that is cleared. It's being cleared right now. So don't be hard on yourself. Again, be mindful of like shady friends or family here. All right. If something doesn't feel right, turns it hard that is not right. All right. Don't let people's opinions um, get in your head too much. Take the leap of faith without a care in the world. You know, be selfish with your time and your thoughts. We have temperance for me, temperance here, Sagittarius, and I think things are going to balance out throughout Gemini season. All right. Lovers and reverse represents Gemini. This simply isn't meant for you. You know, you're the Queen of Pentacles. Showing up as the Queen of Pentacles for a reason. Again, Empress is wearing green. Queen of Pentacles is wearing green. It's time to get grounded. Step back into reality here. But again, don't give a damn about what people think. Go fast towards your goals here. What can Libras expect? A wealthy man. You have a wealthy man coming in. Wealthy man, woman. You know, accept this journey for what it is and keep pushing forward, okay? You have great fortune coming in. Again, a message of concern. Someone's going to be checking on you, but be mindful of your spending as well, all right? And don't be fearful of change, okay? You know, don't be, don't get stuck on disappointing times, okay? So again, you can think about things, but don't stay there, all right, Libras? Keep pushing forward and with your goals with the chariot as well. Things are going to start looking up during Gemini Cancer season, which is in June. All right, Libras, I'm going to leave it here and have a wonderful week.